Well, dang. That was anticlimactic. I really didn't see this movie coming. Well, my tubers, if you guys love talking about movies, this is the place to be. Please hit that subscribe button because 40% of you guys watching this video aren't subscribed. So please hit that subscribe button. Also, hit that like button as well because it really goes a long way in letting me know, letting me know that you guys want more content. Action stars Chris Hemsworth and comes from you from the directors of. Endgame, Infinity War, Civil War, and Winter Soldier and is directed by the guy who does all the stunt coordinator work for all the Avengers movies pretty much and it's pretty much about Chris Hemsworth taking this high profile drug lord's son across the border while other drug lords are trying kid after this kid. Pretty much he has the full city on lockdown and he's coming after him and Pretty much, he's pretty much trying to get there before the they get killed, pretty much. And I would say, this surprised me a lot. I really wasn't interested in this until I heard it was from the guys who worked on the Avengers movies, pretty much. And my favorite movie of all time, Endgame. And as well... It's a stunt coordinator, and last time a stunt coordinator directed the movie, we got John freaking Wick, which was really awesome. And I have to say, this movie, oh my gosh, the stunt work has to be the best stunt work in a movie ever. I see stunt, like, movies studying the stunt choreography in this whole movie alone, because there's this one epic one-shot take of Chris Hemsworth driving around. It's just straight up one take. There are cuts, minimal cuts here and there, but it's him running on the roof, killing all these bad guys, jumping in the car, driving away, getting out of the car, running around, and it's so freaking awesome. I was having a blast with it. And it was so violent and so brutal. It was awesome. It was straight up awesome. This movie is straight up a popcorn movie. It's nothing more, nothing less. And yeah, I had a blast with it. And let's talk about Chris Hemsworth. He does an awesome job, man. Chris Hemsworth is awesome. And the Russo brothers know that this is just a straight up popcorn movie. They don't bother with the backstory. They don't... They just give him the generic, oh, I lost my son backstory. That's why I'm doing this. And, yeah, and there's a surprise cameo by certain Stranger Things guest star as well. That surprised me. I'm like, whoa, what? I'm not going to spoil it for you because I want you guys to check this movie out yourselves. And, yeah, one other thing that surprised the heck out of me, there's this huge helicopter scene at the end of the movie where... A girl takes a rocket launcher, shoots the helicopter down, and it looks like, like there is no CGI. No CGI, and it looks awesome. It really does. And I think they did a really great job with this movie. Really did. And for flaws, like downsides of the movie, some of the CGI is temperamental. You can see, oh, that's fake, but I understand. I feel like they had rushed this out because... Because of the COVID pandemic and all that. But uh, yeah, that's my only real downfall. And I wish they gave the kid that is hanging out with Chris Hemsworth the whole time. That he's smuggling more of a better backstory and more character development. But besides that, this movie was a ball. It was fun. And the funny thing is, 
critics are really mad about this because they're like, all oh, the violence is too violent. I'm like, John Wick game one? Maybe because this is more realistic, more possible, because it could be. Because there are people who own militaries out there who has a lot of money and honestly it could be plausible but overall mt hit it <laughs> i'm giving the extraction a b plus yeah guys i had a lot of fun with this movie if you guys need any quarantine movie just to chill and turn your brain off to this would be one of them and yeah, that's all for this time. Guys, stay tuned for more movie reviews that I'll be covering soon. Because there are a lot of movies I haven't covered yet. And I want to cover them during this quarantine time. So yeah, that's all for this time. Punch that like button face. Like boss. See you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.